Hello everyone, this is Mara and welcome to a new gameplay video. This is World's Dawn and this is a game that I actually got from Steam Summer Sale and I was very excited to try it out. It is uh, inspired by Harvest Moon series and even though I've never played the original Harvest Moon series, I've played a lot of Stardew Valley as many of you know already. And I love, I just simply love all kinds of farming games, so I was definitely very excited to try it out. And in this little video we are going to uh, go through some of the basic starting things in this game. You can see the graphics, you can see the character creation, um, a little bit of the story as well. And yeah, hopefully you guys will enjoy it. And as always, all the links to the Steam page and whatnot, they are in the video description if you want to check this out, this game for yourself. And uh, let's go! So, first of all, there is something that I need to mention. Um, the controls in this game are a little bit interesting. <laughs> you can't use your mouse uh, to play the game, so you are either going to use your uh, entirely your keyboard or your gaming controller. And uh, the... <laughs> <laughs> the keys for the controls were a little bit tricky, but luckily I was able to find uh, a post in the uh, Worldstone forums by some other players who were having the same issues and there was instructions how to how to set the keys for the controls. So you are able to find some inf information if you go to the uh, Steam forums for this game. But anyway, enough babbling. I have played this game actually about three hours yesterday, just after I installed the game. And I can definitely see myself getting very uh, addicted to, to this game. Like I said, I'm just a huge fan of all kinds of um, adorable, relaxing farming simulators. And this is this is definitely a good choice. Okay, so let's go ahead and create a new story. All right. All right, so we have two options, of course, female or a male. Let's go with the female. And there's some uh, hairstyle choices. There are not too many options here, but let's go with let's go with that. And who are you interested interested in romancing? Let's pick men, and we can. Okay, not that, not that. <laughs> okay, there we go. We can pick our name. All right, there we go. Yes, are you ready to start? Yes, I am. Let's go. So I love the art style. It's really adorable. And it's very anime, um, anime style art. So that's lovely. And this game, by the, by the way, uh, just like Stardew Valley, this game is also developed by just one person. It's a passion project for them, as I did read from the uh, from one of the update uh, posts on Steam. So that's just remarkable, if you ask me. <laughs> All right, hi me. And I love that there's a dog here. And you can whistle and a dog will follow you. It's... Oh, I love it. I love it. <laughs> Alright. What are you waiting for, Mara? Your new home is just ahead. Okay, let's walk. And Wayward Prophet is the creator of this game. Okay. 
All right. So we are just going to cover what uh, what happens at the beginning of this game in this video. This is not a series, like I said, it's it's just a little gameplay video for you guys to see how the game looks like and how how it works. Uh huh. Let's see. This is a new home. I love it. Hey. <laughs> oh, there's someone. Go on then. You should say hello. I'm Barley, the mayor of our humble village. You made your first resident of Sugar Blossom Village. Alright, and we can name our dog. Let's name him after my puppy. Because why not? Atos. <laughs> All right. Whoa. Welcome to Sugar Blossom Village. Thank you. <laughs> wow, a handheld camera. All right, so just like take care. Thank you. Yeah, so I'm I'm trying my best not to compare it to Stardew Valley, but I played that game so much that I I have to compare it in some ways but anyway like in Stardew Valley in this game you are uh, going to do some quests as well and the main purpose I guess is to is to uh, save the village in a way okay now I can control it okay so this is my house we have a notebook here and let's see we have some dog food nice the camera pocket diary let's see okay so the pocket diary is where you are able to save the game basically you write an entry and let's see where is it okay there we go notebook okay so here's some tips and hints for the gameplay as well and yeah yeah, so uh, like in Stardew Valley, you are able to do quests. Uh, the main purpose, of, I guess, or the biggest quest is to uh, save the town. Uh, and I'm not going to spoil about the story too much. But anyway, it's it's very uh, similar in a way as in Stardew Valley and probably in, in the original uh, Harvest Moon game as well. Like I did say, I haven't played the original game, so I can't really compare it too much there but let's let's add some some dog food here <laughs> there we go puppy needs some food and let's go outside Our story, your story begins. Wonderful. All right, so I will just quickly show you guys that our little farm plot is up here. You are able to buy seeds from a local farm. You will have to go there, and there's a little well where you can fill your fill your little watering can, and you will receive it as a gift from one of the villagers later on. And the first goal is to go ahead and meet meet some new villagers, meet all the residents. That's the first quest. And this here, this glowing box here is the crate for the shipping goods. 
So that's very, very familiar for any of you guys who have been playing Stardew Valley as well. And there's my puppy. So let's see how the, how this goes. Whistle. <laughs> and he will follow me. I love it. I love it so much. So guys, I'm so tempted to just continue playing this game. It's absolutely adorable. And like I said, I can totally see myself getting very, very addicted to it. And... I did play it like three hours yesterday just after installing the game so I'm definitely looking forward to play it played a lot more off camera and I I'm, I'm thinking that at some some point we are probably going to have it on the channel as well because I really enjoy the game but there we go guys I hope you enjoyed this little gameplay video to show you guys the the main um, main gameplay a little bit it's it's adorable and definitely if you are uh, looking for a very relaxing farming simulator RPG game go ahead and check this out Th there's a link in the video description for the steam page and there we go go ahead and have your own adventures so thank you so much guys for watching if you enjoyed this gameplay video leave a like and comment below and I will see you next time on the channel bye bye